Welcome to the Idaho State University 2020 Virtual Winter Commencement Ceremony. Presenting the Colleges of Idaho State University. Your journey at Idaho State University began with a dream, a dream of becoming more. Some of you, far from home, felt lonely, like you were on your own. Certainly there were moments of feeling overwhelmed, not sure if you were up to the task. Along the way, you gathered your people, your ISU family. There were new friends in the same boat. You struggled together, laughed together. There were faculty who saw your potential, pushing, stretching you to higher levels, simultaneously tough and compassionate. They knew what you could become. Today is your day. That dream of becoming more is no longer a dream. You are forever changed ready to reach out and move the world. From this day forward, you are forever an Idaho State University Bengal. Will the audience please rise for the national anthem? Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the The president of Idaho State University, Kevin Satterley. Congratulations, graduates. On behalf of all of the faculty and staff at Idaho State University, I would like to say that we are proud of you. You represent our success stories. 
You see, we believe in education here, but while we believe in it, you, in fact, are living proof of that belief. And you did not get to this point easily. You have struggled. You, maybe more than any other class in recent memory, those who are part of the class of 2020 have faced adversity in many ways. I know this is not the graduation day that you dreamed of many months or many years ago, but I am proud of the tenacity and the bangle grit that you have shown in the face of these challenges. And today, we celebrate you. And many of you have not only excelled in school during these trying times, but you have done so with financial struggles, with families to raise, and with job obligations. Yet you have still succeeded in your academic endeavors. So take a moment and enjoy that achievement. You did this. You did this. So now you have finished your education. You are preparing to culminate years of hard work and resilience by receiving your degree. But what I ask of you now is that you take the experience that you have gained here at Idaho State University and you take it out into the world and pursue your passion. Know that from where you are today, you can achieve whatever you set your mind to. And I call on you to set your mind to what fulfills you as a person. Build the life that you have dreamed of, that makes you proud and that ultimately brings you happiness and fulfillment. Because this is what education is all about. It is about bettering your life. And by bettering your life, you also have an opportunity to make the world a better place. And you do that by using what you learned here. When you go out into your community, be the person who society needs. Be the change that we need. Use this education, not just to make a living, but to make the community you live in better than it is now. It may already be great, but you can make it even better. Along with your degree comes all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities there too. So I am going to tell you about one of those rights and one of those responsibilities. From now on, you will have the right to forever call yourself a Bengal. The right to tell the world proudly that you are a graduate of Idaho State University. That is your right. Now, here is your responsibility. And I charge you and task you with this now. Right here, right now. Go out in the world and make us proud. Live that better life and never forget your roar. Congratulations. And now it is my distinct privilege to introduce your 2020 student speaker, Susan Brooks. If you could see where I've come from to where I am now, you too would be thanking ISU for work well done. My very first day of class at ISU was 10 years ago. And for the record, I would not recommend taking a six year break in the middle of your degree program. <laughs> but as I lingered down the hallway to my classroom, I was bypassed by a young man who asked if I was the professor. <laughs> not knowing whether to be honored or offended by his remark, I considered just turning around and completely forgetting about pursuing education in midlife. Yet determining that older does not equate wiser, I decided to stay and pursue greatness, something that I now believe has no age limit. A decade later, I find myself embracing challenges that used to intimidate me. You see, dodging things that look daunting and searching for the safer pathway was one of my trademark maneuvers. <laughs> Yet now, I'm almost excited to take on new challenges. 
I mean, it's fun to dream of good ideas, but now I'm just as likely to follow through with them as to just sit and think of them. For instance, I recently opened my own t-shirt and gift business that's all about love for the state of Idaho. When I moved back here from a six-year stint in Colorado, I noticed that Idahoans paled in comparison to Coloradans when it came to expressing their love for their state. During my degree program, I have honed some marketing skills that have come in quite handy. And of course, there's my favorite, the financial management skills, so that I'll know exactly what to do with that extra million dollars. <laughs> in all seriousness, as I look out over my life, I can point to half a dozen changes that Idaho State University has helped to produce, with the most notable and sustained change being my overall confidence level. I used to hate board meetings for my husband's business because nearly everything went over my head. Yet now, I have worthwhile input for those meetings. And just the other day, I was reading how the Women's Business Center has come to Southeast Idaho, and I thought, Maybe I should volunteer there. My next thought, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just thought that about myself. I am genuinely transformed. Also, where I formerly despised job hunting, I'm now actually looking forward to it, for it is my core belief that I am well-educated and I am well-prepared for a career in business. Like other Bengals here today, Idaho State University has helped shape me into the person that I am. And I expect that my fellow graduates from all disciplines have journeys of their own that also cultivate in Thanksgiving for the many opportunities to grow. So from the bottom of our hearts, to the ISU faculty and staff, and to all the family and friends who have stood by our sides through this incredible journey, thank you for affording us the opportunity to be strengthened stretched and transformed. Thank you, Idaho State University, for our brighter futures. And look out, world, there is no masking the power of the winter class of 2020. We are about to be unleashed. Provost and Executive Vice President, Dr. Laura Woodworth Nye. Thank you, Susan. Congratulations to you and to all of our graduates. None of us would be here without the support and guidance we've received along the way from beloved mentors. At this time, I would like to express sincere appreciation to the members of the university faculty who have been especially flexible and resilient during this trying year of uncertainty. Thank you for your dedication to our students and to your discipline. And now graduates, the moment you have all been waiting for, Will the candidates for all graduate degrees please rise? President Satterley, I am pleased to present to you the candidates for doctoral degrees, graduate certificates, master's degrees, and specialist degrees. Upon the recommendation of the deans of the colleges and of the faculty, I recommend that these degrees be conferred. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the trustees of Idaho State University and upon recommendation of the college deans and the university faculty, I hereby confer upon you, upon completion of the requirements, the appropriate doctoral, master's, and specialist degrees with all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Will all candidates for graduate degrees watching from home Please prepare to be hooded by your designated family members or friends as your name is called. Harishchandra Aryal, Doctor of Philosophy. David Kal Sagara, Doctor of Philosophy. Amy Salina Commendador Dudgeon. Doctor of Philosophy, Jonathan Edward Dudko, Doctor of Arts, Robert Thomas Etnire, Doctor of Philosophy, Ruth Brooke McNeil, 
Doctor of Arts. Jason L. Swanson, Doctor of Philosophy. Allison Wells, Doctor of Philosophy. Jessica Ray Whitaker Forneck, Doctor of Philosophy. I would like to thank my advisor, family, friends, and many more people for helping me earn my PhD. Mark Thomas Williams, Doctor of Philosophy. Ali Anwar Albish. Nicolina Devona Allen. Cody W. Allen. Joseph Laster Boring. Rachel Ann Brinkley. Connor Matthew Casanova. Lytle P. Denny. Scott Bradley Greaves. Anit Gurung. Blaine Eric Gustafson. Brittany Ray Guzzo. Stacy Lynn Henderson. Pamela Bernadette Paggaliwanglin Manglona. Austin Cody Mathis. Joseph James McCullough. Mary B. Meyer Peter. Cody Lee Milney. Omokunli Alabadi Oguntade. Sarah Rebecca Oli. Nathaniel Seth Oldham. Cammy J. Parsons. Kenneth Allen Stone. Maria Angelica Tangarif Garson. Garrett Scott Thompson. And now for our candidates for undergraduate degrees. Would all those seeking bachelor and associate degrees and certificates please rise? President Satterley, I am pleased to present to you the candidates for the honors bachelor's degree, bachelor's degree, associate degree, and certificates. Upon the recommendations of the deans of the colleges and the faculty, I recommend that these degrees be conferred. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of Idaho State University and upon recommendation of the college deans and the university faculty, I hereby confer upon you, upon completion of requirements, the appropriate bachelor's and associate degrees with all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. At this time, I invite you to move your tassel from the right side to the left, a symbol of having attained your degree. Congratulations. Please enjoy the following recognition of graduates from your college. Abdul Rahman Ali Mohammed Abdul Karim. Abdullah KHKMK Abedin. Mubarak Mishari Atam Alamji. Mohammad Alazemi. Omar Mohammad Al Bukhari. 
Ahmed Aliyad. Benjamin Clifford Alexander. Mohammad Jasem Al Hassan. Mohammad Al Hamlan. Fahed Al Huraiti. Othman A. Al Khandri. Ahmad Al Kayat. Haydar Abdullah M. Al Khalidi. Maki Hussein Al Mashana. Omran Salah Al Omran. Saud Faisal Al Otaibi. Khaled J M A Al Tanib. Cash Reed Anderson, Cordell J. Anderson, Joshua John Ball, Eric Scott Bergman, Dylan Jason Brown. Nicola Prudence Bernadette Chin, Amber Lee Christensen, Alyssa Ruth the Smith, Scott Vincent Dressen, Nico John Alardi. Catherine Lynn Englund, Amanda Rose Escobar, Karina Marie Ferguson, Jennifer Lane Garrett, Dipesh Gimri. Cole J. Gregson, Ulyssa Isabella Guzman, Justin James Hanley, Maha Khalid Jamshed, Jacob Grant Johnson. Aaron Paul Johnson. Present, Karmacharya. Dari Abdullah Kelaib. Abdul Mosen Kalaib. Michael Andrew Knight. Andrew Jake Lancaster, Dylan Joseph Lasher, Mark Anthony Benando Liban, Zachary J McPherson, Francisco Madrigal Jr. Nabin Raj Mahat, Mahesh Mahat, Abdulaziz Mansouri, Logan Paul Martinez, Michael Ty McDonald. Chandra Miseldin, Delaney Elizabeth Moore, Hamed Oleyola Moshud, 
Derek Brian Nielsen. Kennelly Orme. Fagun Patel. Sandro Andreas Politis. Luke Amos Peoples. Brayden Lynn Piper. Jeffrey Christian Powell. Marty C. Quisito. Rosetta Fern Roberts. Richa Sapkota. Amar Shrestha. Sabine Shrestha. Aubriana Beth Stieglitz. Isaac Thomas Surchik. Ryan Paul Syndergaard. Yaha A. Tar. Jonathan L. Taylor. Nicholas Nathan Taylor. Prasis Similsena. Xerxes Joaquin Tirado. Tala J. Togai. Bradley Tyler. Oscar I. Velasquez. Irene Vincente Lorena. David Lawrence Zerker. Anthony E. Davis. Vanessa Dixon. ISU grads, congratulations from the College of Science and Engineering. I'm Scott Snyder and I'm Dean of the college. You have completed one of the most difficult degrees ISU has to offer. Take some time to celebrate today, tomorrow, the next day, and mostly just be very proud of yourself. Your degree poises you to embark on a successful career or on continued studies. In either case, your learning won't stop. I hope that in future years, when you look back at your time at ISU, you find that the knowledge you gained here was not as important as how an ISU education taught you to learn and grow. Now that you're alum alumni, some of you will stay close to home, others will travel the world. Wherever you land, I hope that you will stay connected to ISU and the College of Science and Engineering. I hope that you interact with your fellow alums, that you stay in touch with your favorite professors, and that you let us know of all of your goals and all of your accomplishments. We are proud to have you as Bengals. Congratulations and be well. Congratulations, graduates. You have worked hard to get here. The degree that has been conferred upon you signifies the achievement of a goal of great worth, a great accomplishment. Now each of you are forever a member of the Bengal family, and you are also forever a member of the Idaho State University Alumni Association. This Bengal family is here to support you as you go out into the world and pursue the life you have dreamed of. Graduates, I know that you worked very hard to get here, but we also know that every achievement is not achieved alone. It is through the support of dedicated families and friends that you can stand here today. So now that they have cheered you on, graduates, take a moment and thank and recognize the family members and friends for their love and support while Micah Kenny performs the university's alma mater.
Graduates, congratulations. Congratulations, the class of 2020. Bengals, you did it. Roar, Bengals, roar. Congratulations, graduates. My name's Ryan Sargent. I'm the Director of Alumni Relations here at Idaho State. We are so proud of you and your accomplishments. Welcome to the Alumni Association. Hello, my name's Ashley Kinzel. I'm an ISU alumni, and I just wanted to say congratulations to the graduating class of 2020 and go Bengals. Congratulations, graduates, class of 2020. Dirk Cutter here, Idaho State class of 1981, wishing you the best of luck. Crazy times, but all the former grads were all behind you. Go Bengals. Hey Bengal grads, congratulations to the class of 2020. We wish you the best as you embark on the next part of your journey. Go Bengals. Congratulations. Congratulations class of 2020. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Bengal, Bengal family. family. Congratulations class of 2020. I'm so excited for you that you obtained your degree from Idaho State University. Go forth, do good, and go Bengals. Hey, class of 2020, it's Stephanie Adams from class of 2001. I just wanted to say congratulations on your graduation and to wish you the best of luck in all you do. Hello, ISU class of 2020. I'm Ratimu Aduke, class of 2008. Congratulations on an outstanding achievement. I hope as you go out into the world, you'll continue to feel a part of the Bengal family. Go Bengals! This is Terry Fredrickson. I graduated in the class of 2005 in political science. Hey, recent graduate, 2020 graduate, congratulations. Uh, not only do I want to say congratulations, but I want to welcome you to the family. Uh, now you're part of a family that's called alumni. Congratulations, class of 2020. This is definitely one for the books. Us here at the ISU Alumni Association are so proud of you and we just wish you the best. We hope you continue to support ISU and roar Bengals roar. Hello, we're Ryan and Shawnee Burt from Twin Falls, Idaho. We are proud alumni of Idaho State University and we want to take this moment to congratulate you on your wonderful achievement of graduation. And welcome to the Alumni Association, you're all part of it now. Congratulations and go, go Bengals! Bengals! Hi, I'm Scott Turner, President of the ISU Alumni Board. Well, graduates, you've done it. You have your certificate or your degree and you're off. But we look forward to seeing you again in the very near future, coming back to campus as alumni. Hey Bengals, this is Marvin Lewis, wishing you congratulations on your graduation. Congratulations, class of 2020. You each have worked so hard to get to this moment. Take a deep breath and be present. You deserve it. Congratulations, graduates. You are officially Bengals. Go out into the world, make a difference, and when people ask, tell them you graduated from THE Idaho State University. Good luck. Way to go. Go Bengals. Hey, Bengal grads. This is Tynan O'Neill from Champaign, Illinois, from class of 2015. Congratulations. I'm so proud of you all. Get out there and make a big difference in this world. From Kansas City, Missouri, this is the Stokes family. From one Bengal family to the other, you did it. Congratulations. Even in a pandemic!